Can you change this hanging down light for a little spotlight in the ceiling? Of course I can. I can do anything. Here we go. And this light fitting has a live and neutral coming in and the live and neutral going out. And then the switch wire obviously dropped down to the switch. But that is in blue and brown as well. And I can guarantee you that little bit of sleeving, it has, it's fell off. So I'm just going to chop the end off of the switch wire so I know exactly which one it is when I've pulled it to bits. And yes, this might be a bit lazy, but I'm just going to mark out the circle on the ceiling and cut it out of a pad saw. It's one down light. I'm not going to drill out for one down light. And to join all the cables in the ceiling, nice and neat, I've got the quick bit quick fix jb4 and here we're going to do we're just going to put the way goes in there's a three which will be for the loop and live loop live in and out and then there's a decent size one for the earth and then another little three for your neutrals and then this is going to be your switch live so there we go all the terminals inside of one box and all i'm going to do is bring out the switch live in neutral but to basically go onto the plug for the light this is one down light with a plug on there, so it'll be fine. I just want to keep the junction box in the ceiling under no strain. Nice and neat. So I have to get in the live neutral switch live inside this junction box with plenty of room. All inside the way goes exactly how they should be. Let's close it up and stick that back in the ceiling. And before you say it, yes, I did put cable ties on the box too. So... Yeah, that one's the wrong way around to start with. But I put cable ties on the box, tied it all up. And it's always a good idea to plug it in and make sure it works. Yeah, before you bleed in, stick it in the ceiling. Because if it doesn't work, you've got to get it back out. But yes, it was spot on. Of course it was. So that fits in there nice and neat. And the plug and everything just goes straight into the ceiling. Exactly how I planned. All we've got to do now is stick that white bezel on, which is magnetic. And of course, pack away. Put my little Lux light in its little case. This is a lifesaver light. This is one of them ones that fit inside your tool bag. And every time you do need it, because electric, as electricians, we turn the bleeding lights out all the time. So have this stuck in your bag, in this little pouch, charge it up in your van. Click on the link and grab yourself one for your tool bag.